Hey Virgo, this is your love message. This is timeless and I wanted to get this out to you because I was feeling the need for all of the signs actually to get a message out to you guys. So I have pulled four cards and this, these are love messages. So if this is love for yourself, could be love for another person. But the first card here is retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. So th these messages are specifically for you, okay? And retreat represents, um, it, basically this card talks about how your love life blossoms as you spend time alone with someone in particular or by yourself. So. There's a situation here going on in your life where, in your love life, where you feel confused or conflicted by maybe other people's advice or um, something that somebody else has been telling you. And it feels like it's time for you to disconnect so that you can better hear your own feelings and opinions. And if you're in a partnership, spending time together apart from other people will renew your commitment and take it to the next level. This could also mean taking a vacation. Um, when it's time, going on a nature hike, enjoying a long drive, or turning off phones and computer as you both enjoy a quiet, quiet afternoon together. Um, the painting on this card also represents or indicates a honeymoon, which that could be the actual message. So there may be a deepening of commitment or a new serious relationship if you're single. This card could indicate an upcoming engagement a wedding or a renewal of vows. And these activities are more meaningful as you spend time alone with your person. If you are presently single, Virgo, this card is guiding you to spend time by yourself, meditating upon your true feelings and thoughts. Be sure to take action based on any intuitive guidance because this strengthens your energy, which helps you rapidly attract and manifest a loving partner. Now you also have the soulmate card. Your soulmate is already with you in spirit. Believe this and they will manifest physically. Okay, so that's a just kind of like I heard a little exercise. Somebody said, make a list of uh, like uh, kind of write down, create your soulmate, write it on paper of what this type of person would fit with you. The, the t if you are currently single or if there are things in a partnership that um, you feel could use improvement um, within yourself and within that person to write all that stuff down and begin manifesting that person when you have an idea, especially if you're single, of what type of person you would like to share your life with, okay? Now you also have the self-care card. So the self-care card is pretty evident and very important for you at this time for some reason. You guys, um, if you've been through a breakup or if you are on your own, it's really important for you um, to kind of have this retreat for rest and self-care. So if you are looking at this card and and kind of like breathing a sigh of relief, that is a huge sign of needing a healing pause. So self-care can take many forms, but the most important thing is for you to look after yourself in a way that promotes your happiness, health, and high energy. So this could be some of you need to really focus double down on detoxing your diet or getting away from any harsh energy relationships or circumstances. Taking great care of yourself will have you flying higher and free like a butterfly. So either go on a retreat by yourself or with somebody else, simplify your life, assert yourself and learn to say no. And it's interesting because you also have health and healing. So as a Virgo, of course, you're all about that. <laughs> Virgos are all about healing. So with this card, this really, I mean, obviously it's, it's evident, but this card talks about, um, getting yourself, uh, in a healthy healing, a better situation. Cause I feel like some of you, you, there may be a need to heal the mental aspects of your life. Okay. This could be healing an illness or an injury. Um, this could represent you being a healer, healing thyself, helping to heal others. Um, it's also a good time, a good and safe time for you to change to a healing career. 
okay? Some of you may already be doing that. Or study healing modalities, okay? So um, you're just, whatever you decide to do here in your life, you're supported in making life changes so that you can continue to heal yourself and others, let go of any fears or restrictive thinking to fully open the miracles of healing. So this is a very simple message for you guys to really be focusing on taking time out for yourself and practicing self-care and health and healing. Some of you are single. Some of you are coming out of a relationship. Some of you are struggling in a connection with a lover, family member, spouse, whatever it might be. And there is an energy here. This has to do with a soulmate. And there's an energy here of like you needing to make yourself a priority now. Okay. It, one, you're listening to this reading. It's, again, timeless. You may need to come back to this a few times because you so much want to help others and you want to inspire people and you're such a caretaker. And um, But see, if you're depleting yourself, drawing energy from yourself to help others, then you will be empty. So this message is inspiring you to take a time out, take a pause, for however long you need it, not for however long anyone else needs it. You know, whether that's a mental, physical, emotional, or spiritual pause, it's okay to take a break. It's okay to give yourself this time to care for all of these facets of yourself, okay? Some of you may just need to start an exercise routine, or you've been thinking about it, or maybe tweaking your diet a bit, or um, joining some, being involved in some type of extracurricular activity that you've always wanted to do kind of like in this place of rediscovering yourself and I know a lot of you have been doing that um, but there seems to be a need to be reminded about this okay and um, yeah so that's your message I hope that you enjoyed that and please do come back and listen to this anytime you like if you just need a refresher and um, I wish you all the best stay safe and healthy okay take care